Hi everybody, it's me, Kathleen. Welcome to another vlog. I'm gonna be doing a mini haul of the items that I got this January. So, let's begin! So, I'm going to start off with the items that I got from Watson's three days ago. What I got were just my essentials. So first, let's start with something that I haven't used in a while. Yes, guilty. I haven't used lotion in a while. So what what I used before I, w I bought this was the Nivea one. But then I was comparing the prices and I realized that it was just expensive for my budget so i got this instead it's the vaseline deep restore total moisture i love moisturizing lotions that talk about repairing your skin and you know deeply moisturizing your skin i love items that do that i'm hoping that my skin will be fine with this okay so let's move on to the next i'm just gonna put this here next since i already ran out of this i bought my sunblock yes this is the sunblock that i use for my face so this is my daytime skincare routine it's just actually sunblock it's the nivea sun protect and moisture spf 30 um this I, I think that this can be both for the face and body well i'm not really an expert but ever since i use this for my face ever since i started using this on my face um i've actually grown to like it and my skin has responded to this product well so i continue to use it and it's also affordable compared to some brands in the market for me next thing that i got from watson's is my nighttime moisturizer which is the i've mentioned this in one of my vlogs before the looks organics soothing gel so this is the original one that i really use it's the 99.85 percent aloe vera one um i used to buy the one in the tub but my friend dana told me that she prefers this kind of packaging because it's more hygienic since you just put the amount to your hands or fingers you don't have to dip your fingers in the tub which might contaminate the entire product so I thought of it and I thought I thought she was right so this is better the one in the tub was 300 ml and this single pack contains 100 ml so I bought three three times the charm and this is also more convenient for when you travel right and the last item that I bought from Watson's is this Vaseline Lip Therapy Original for moisturizing my lips. I haven't opened it yet because I wanted to show this to you guys with its packaging. Actually, there was still some left from my old lip moisturizer, but I threw it away because it got contaminated with something. So I bought another one. So this is what I use for my lips. I interchangeably use this with the Nivea one also, also the original one. So if this is not available, I buy the Nivea one. And if Nivea is not available, then I buy this one. That was all that I bought from Watson's. Really, just my essentials. You know, when you go to Watson's, I suggest that you make a list of the things that you need to buy. Because when you go there, and you see all this attractive packaging you think that oh i want to buy that i want to buy that when actually you don't need them and you end up going over your budget um for some who can afford then go but for those who are like me 
who are always budgeting their money, then I suggest you always make a list before you go to the store to buy what you need. So you don't end up impulse buying or shopping. Just a suggestion. And after going to Watson's, I went to the Philippine Christian Bookstore across Li Plaza because I wanted to buy a planner. I usually get the planner from there because, ta-da, it's usually thin, easy to carry, affordable. This only costs 30 pesos and what I love about it is that it is designed with verses from the Bible to uplift you, to guide you, and see, for example, for the month of January, it says here, Forget the former things. Do not dwell on the past. See, I am doing a new thing. Now it springs up. Do you not perceive it? I am making a way in the wilderness and streams in the wasteland. Isaiah chapter 43 verses 18 to 19. This is my type of planner where all the days in the month are found in an entire page. Because... It's like a calendar, you know? You can keep track of the days while noting which specific days you want to get some things done. It's very simple. It's not complicated. This is the only thing that I got from PCBS or the Philippine Christian Bookstore. And the one in charge there was so nice because they ran out of this, actually. And then she said that she had still one left. But... She told me that she was gonna give this as a gift to another person. But since I wanted to purchase one, she gave it to me. And of course, I paid for it. Thank you, Ate, if you're watching Char. And for the last item, I mean, for the last items that I bought that day, I bought some foot socks. I love these foot socks. These are actually very affordable. And these are from, can you guess? 7-Eleven. Yes. I discovered this foot socks when I was in Gihulngan. And I forgot to bring my foot socks. And we had to travel the next day. So I bought from them. And I really love it because the material is similar to the one used for stockings but they are thicker so when i use them with my sneakers or my crocs um it's so easy to insert my feet in my footwears because they're just thin and they're durable the first foot socks of this kind that i bought were from 2018 and i still have them now they haven't torn and I really love it. It's just 30 pesos. So I got three. Ta da! So those were all the things that I bought from January 8th. I hope you liked it. It was very short. The items were very few. But I hope it kept you engaged. Did I use that right? Anyway, see you in the next vlog. Bye!